uh, within not only New York City, often in the entire country, uh, in the entire United States of America. This is the number one zip code. Um, to give you an idea, uh, Donald Trump, and that's the last time I'll mention that name. Oh, <laughs> I promise you. Uh, yeah, I try not to utter it I, unless I have to. But where he's living is right the south side of the park. So if he's here, if all his luxury buildings are around here, you get a pretty good idea of what's surrounding the park, right? Um, and I talk about that, so he, yes, he is there, but also just in general, this is very much uh, the highest in real estate. And I mention it because what's out there has a direct effect on what's in here, and what's in here directly affects what's out there. There's a very symbiotic relationship between these two entities. That's something we'll explore a bit more as well. So that's everything surrounding the park. Uh, within the park, first we're seeing the Great Lawn. We'll, we'll be at the Great Lawn momentarily, so I'll wait to talk about it till then. Uh, but just what I'll mention here is if anyone's seen massive concerts like 10,000, 20,000 people, Simon and Garfunkel or Global Citizen or, you know, that sort of thing, that's where that, that goes down. So that's Garfunkel. the Great Lawn. And then um, the Kira Turtle Pond again will be there. The other thing I'm getting some questions about is that theater over there. That's Delacorte Theater.